Hello dear students of class 7. Today we are going to study part 10 of the chapter 9 using list images and links. Students, in this part we are going to study creating an email link. Okay, so let us quickly begin with it. Now students, what is an email link? Okay, an email link, let me show you with the help of an example. Suppose I have opened this website of this St. Francis School, Gomtinagar, Lucknow. Okay. Now students, you can see over here, there is a, this mail icon and there is a email ID written over here. Okay. Now see over here, my mouse pointer behaves like a arrow. Okay. Normal. But as soon as I bring this over this email address or this icon over here, it becomes a small hand. Yes, my mouse pointer becomes the small hand. That means this is not a simple text. It is a link. Now, if I will click on this link, something special will happen. What is going to happen students? As soon as I click on this link, see my default email service will open. What is email service? It email service is a service, okay, that is provided you uh, provided to you uh, by different companies like Gmail, Yahoo, etc. Okay, they pro they provide you with a service that you can send emails to different people. Okay, now students see normally if I want to send an email to anyone, what I have to do, I have to open my email service. Okay, I have to open my email account. Right now, my email account is open over here. And I need to click on this new mail icon over here. Okay, I press on this new mail or this plus button. And then over here in the from section, my email address is already displayed. Okay, and now in the to section over here, I have to type the email address of that particular person whom I want to send. Okay, so I need to type the, uh, this. Uh, if I want to send any email to any person, I need to type the email address over here in the to section. But what is the then what is the purpose of this email link? Students, the purpose of this email link is that it allows the visitors to send an email message quickly. The quickly is the keyword over here. Now see, if I use this email link on this website, now I'm visit. I'm a visitor of this website, right? This is not my website, but I'm a visitor of this website. Okay. So if I want to send email address to the owners of this website, what I have to do, I have to click on this email link and quickly what is going to happen? My email service will open the email service, which I, have, I use on this computer. Okay, the default email service that I use on this computer, it will open and automatically you can see in the to section, the email address of that website is copied over here. I have not copied it. It happened automatically. How did that happen? This happened because of, you know, as this is not a normal link, this is an email link. Okay, so let us study how to create an email link on a web page. Okay, so you can create a link on the web page. Okay, you can create an email link on the web page by using the mail to colon. Okay, it is mail to then colon is there students. Okay, colon is very important. Okay, now this mail to colon allows the visitors to send an email message quickly. Okay, quickly. Mail to is not actually a HTML tag. Now this a mail to is not an HTML tag, but a separate program or a function that you can use along with the, the HTML tag. Okay. Now you can use this mail to function. Okay. Mail to function. You can use this mail to function along with this anchor tag. Okay. And you can create an email link. It creates a link that allows the user to write and send email to the specified address. Okay. So if I go over here, what is the specified address? This contact at the rate stfrancislq.org. Right. If I want to send an email to this 
to this address i just need to click on this and my default email service will open now one thing you need to know students is that you need to log into your uh, you need to have an email account and you need to log into that email account uh, on your computer okay when you practice this you need to log into the uh, def uh, default email service on your uh, this computer otherwise it will not work okay so it creates a link that allows the user to write and send email address to uh, email to the specified address now you can specify multiple addresses by separating each one with a comma and space okay so instead of using a single email address you can also use multiple email addresses you have to separate those with the help of comma and space okay now the mail to function is supported by all the major browsers okay that means this mail to function is supported by all the browsers now let us see how to do it so see what they have done they have used the html tag then the head tag then the title tag okay in the title they have written something they have closed the title tag there is the head tag then the body tag inside the body tag they have given a bg color as pink and they have given left margin as 75 and top margin as 50 okay now over there over here they have written something inside the body what they have written inside the h1 heading okay so this is what they have written you are welcome to mail us your suggestions regarding our books okay so they have written some text over here and then they have closed this h1 tag this is the heading tag as you know it and then they have given a line break this br stand for breaking the line so break they have broken the line and they have come to the next line and then they have uh, used the center tag to keep whatever is written inside this in the center then they have used this anchor tag which is the most important thing that we are here to study okay so they have used this anchor tag then they have used href you know this is the hyperlink reference yes hyperlink reference attribute of the anchor tag we have used this many a times earlier to create links okay now inside this href the value after this equal to inside this value they have used this mail to function okay inside the value or uh, inside this after this equal to they have used this mail to function mail to colon okay and then after this colon you type the email address of the of the you know that particular website okay or any person you want to send the email so this is the email address which will be written after mail to colon you write the email address and then you close this arrow okay and now this is the hypertext which is written between the on anchor tag and off anchor tag okay and now when you click on this hypertext that means over here when you click on this what will happen your default email uh, email service will open okay and then this email address okay info at the rate whatever is written after this mail to colon whatever is written after this mail to colon this will be automatically typed in the to section of the email okay so let us quickly practice this okay uh, let us make this coding okay so i have opened my notepad and then i have typed the h i have started with html tag then the head tag after head tag what comes the title inside title i can give any name okay i am writing email link okay you can write anything and then close the title then after this close the head tag now now we open the body tag now i don't want to do anything fancy okay so i'll just give bg color equal to i can give any color so i am giving pink okay bg color i am not giving margins or anything now students what i need to uh, create i am just going to create a simple link okay so this i'll just type some uh, random text okay uh, in a uh, using the font tag font uh, size 
equal to uh, suppose five. Okay. Now I'll type this. Uh, sorry, this uh, to contact us to contact us. You can mail us. Okay, I've given some message over here. It doesn't matter if you don't give the message. Okay, I've and now I'm closing the font tag. Okay, this is just a message. Okay, then after this, I will just uh, type what uh, I will give the I will use the anchor tag. Okay, now I'll use this anchor tag and the href attribute of this anchor tag. Okay, to create what to create a link. Okay, email link. Now I'm going to use after this equal to what I'm going to do. I'm going to write mail to function. This is the mail to function. Very important to create email link. This is the syntax that you are going to use anchor tag href href attribute equal to then double quotes. Okay, mail to function mail to colon. Now over here we need to write the email address of the uh, you know email address to which we want to send the email okay suppose we want to send email to suppose uh, let's see facebook okay uh, not facebook suppose this is one of my friend wiki at the rate gmail dot com so i'm going i have written the email address of my friend okay and then i close this double quotes and then i close this arrow bracket and now this is the on anchor tag now i will read click here to mail us okay so this is the hyper text this is the hyper text when you will click on this text what will happen you can send an email to the, this address okay and now i will close this anchor tag then i will close the body tag and now i'll close the html tag and now after writing this code i will just save this file save as this file i will give it any name email link dot html okay it is very essential that you save the file with the dot html uh, this uh, extension save it and then open the folder so i guess it's saved in search for the file okay i'm not getting my file i'll again see where it has saved Save as. Okay, I'll save in this folder. So my file is now saved. I'll just look for my file. Okay, this is the file that I've saved email link dot html. When I open this file, so see, this is the uh, this is the message text that was written and this click here to mail us. Okay, this is the email link. This is the hypertext. Okay, this is the hyperlink. When I click on this, what will happen? See, my default email service has opened and whatever address, email address I specified over there, that email address is copied in the to section of this uh, email. Okay, now I just need to write the subject of the email and then over here i will write the message and then i will click on the send button and the email will be sent to this person so this is how students using the anchor tag and its href attribute and the mail to colon function you can create an email link in html okay with this we come to the end of this chapter okay uh, if you have any doubts regarding this particular topic, you can ask me in the comment section. I will be more than happy to answer your queries. And thank you for listening. Take care of yourself and be well.